How you doing guys? Um, here I, we're on my uh, iPhone 4S. Uh, I'm going to show you some things and this has to do with the use of the lock screens. Obviously people don't want other people to get on their phone and get their personal information, financial data and so on. So they utilize lock screens whether it be the uh, four digit pin or even the new Touch ID fingerprint scanner. Um, but sometimes you want information on the lock screen in case the uh, phone gets lost. Uh, how they can contact you, get it back, or uh, emergency medical information. And I'm going to kind of show you that now, what it looks like. And here's a lock screen there. As you can see, it's got my picture, so people know it's my phone. Look at the picture, uh, phone number, and email uh, if I leave my phone somewhere. And unfortunately, it keeps on going off. And so I'm going to talk about how to do this now, really... Um, all it utilizes is you're just editing the wallpaper and then you save that to your lock screen and there are several ways you can do that and here um, you can use some apps uh, over which is really just allows you to put um, text over the wallpaper and then you can do it that way and then uh, now of course when you do this um, you have to be careful to do it right in the center of the screen. If not, it may be blocked by um, the top or the bottom with the time and the date and all that. But um, there's also other programs as well. In, in this case, ICE, Emergency Contact. Uh, or um, different things anyway. <laughs> so anyway, this is called ICE right here. And uh, here you can... Uh, put your uh, basic information here, uh, emergency contact, or um, this is really made for medical use, but I use it for my uh, uh, phone number and email and things, but you can't put your medical data here. A contact list um, as well. And so we're actually going to, uh, once you have all this filled out in your um, profile page, uh, we're going to go to extra because we're actually going to launch the wallpaper maker and it gives you several options um, I think here it gives you five here's another one uh, one right here and there's the picture one uh, we're gonna go ahead and do this and now you can also go to settings and then you can once you have uh, you can either tick or untick whatever you want to put in the uh, the wallpaper and which you save to your profile page and then once you're done there and then you would click create wallpaper in the bottom and then it uh, saves it so now to use that you actually have to go out of the app and then go into your settings and into your wallpaper and brightness here and it should be located in your camera roll and I got several here down there and that's the one that I was using you would set and obviously uh, as your lock screen so um, that can be very useful if you lose your iPhone or from uh, medical information that could save your life 